let's start this. Hey, this is a test stream, but whatever. Might as well record it. Um, so, hey, welcome. I'm just going to be doing boring roulettes. This is boring content. Uh, but if you if you just need more of me, here it is. Um, basically, just, just testing and making sure all my, my frame rates are buttery. Luckily... At six... What? That doesn't make any sense. Huh? Why is this reading as 60? Wait, hold on. Hold on a minute. But now it's through so Because it's Yulmore? There's no way it's... Was it really just I can't render that many frames in that area? Yulmore takes my FPS too many people. Oh, okay. Uh, I was having issues before where like... Um, what was causing the flickering? I don't know. Sending my capture card 120 hertz. Oh, B Hubs, thanks for the prime sub. Uh, Nathan, thank you for all the cheers too. I always get 144 and you'll more again on 55. Okay, then maybe I was freaking out for no reason. Um, let me uh, let me queue back up then. Sorry, boys. Sorry, everyone in, in queue. Um, well, let me go to where the flavor is then. Uh, okay. Okay, well, thank you. Thank you for. Uh, talking me off the ledge, uh, I was about to lose my mind. Because sometimes if the game v-syncs, it'll, uh, it'll drop to 60. Um, and I'm trying to make sure that I can keep one, 120 on my gaming monitor, send 60 hertz to capture. Um, so, let's... Okay, yeah, alright. What's this about other settings? Uh, silent Ocalypse? What do you mean? What you mean, boy? What you mean, boy? Oh! Friend requests? Oh, display limits. Is that what you were talking about? Oh, check your object and character display number. Got you. I want them all. I want them all. I don't see that in other settings, though. My... Oh. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Try changing it in Yomore. I was just I was just freaking out about uh, V-Sync issues, that's all. I really don't mind it dropping to 60 in that area. Um, hello, Joss Navar. Okay. As long as it's as long as it's hitting like 120 and stuff. As long as the game isn't limiting its render rate, which is what I was freaked out about. Um, hey Austin, little potatoes doing well. Uh, just gotta get up to 450 so I can do the new or 455, excuse me, so I can do the new content. So, yeah. Uh, doing more raids today? Yes, sort of. I'm just doing doing whatever I need to get better gear, really. Hopping around. Give me some triple triad. Give me something to pass the time here. There's no triple triad and maybe I already did it all. What's up, Betray You? Betray You, thank you. Hello, hello. Thank you for dropping in. Hello, oh, Loki. Seven month anniversary. Hey, AK. Good to see you again. If I resubscribe before my last subscription was up, does it add time to the end of my last one? Twisted Irish, I'm pretty sure it does, yes. It's directly related to your monitor's hertz. If your monitor can do over 60, then any frame rate increases will be throttled by your hardware. That's if, yeah, if you have VSync on and a couple of other options. It's much more, uh, much more complicated than that. Um, like Kana, I am on Primal. Data Center Primal. I also have a, um, I have a, cr I set up a cross-world link shell, um, the Lars Lads, um, but I can only, I can only invite people that are on my friends list, uh, so, if you, if you wanna, if you wanna, uh, people have been, ch in chat, some people have been asking about playing and, and partying up and stuff, so, send me a friend request, I'll add you. And then I'll add you to the cross-world link shell, and then we can coordinate that way. Because um, I think I can send... Yeah, I can send invites this way. Hello, Mr. Pinchy Claw. I like your name. Set up a fellowship? I did. Uh, people said that fellowships were bad. So there's also this fellowship. Um, 
let's see here. But you can't invite to group from this, so... I guess I can just go through the fellowship and invite everyone to the link shell and then invite them from the link shell to a party. Uh, yeah, it's complicated. So there is a fellowship. I guess I can go through here and invite from here into Crossworld link shell, which is complicated, but sure, fuck it. Oh, that was you again. Oh, Don the Dragon Wilson, sick. Oh, you can't invite them if they're offline. Okay. Neat. I don't know if they're online or not. I mean, everybody's off. It doesn't say if they're on offline or offline here. Maybe the star does? No? No. Incoming quest for Link Shell? Alright. I'll add you. Oh! We can't add you as a friend when you're offline. Like, I'm at work right now. Yeah, okay, so Dreyfus, yeah, I guess... Join the fellowship, and then I'll send you an invite when you're online. I guess it's just gonna... We're gonna have to, like... It's gonna be... It's gonna be things crossing in the night, I guess. It sucks. I'm sorry, guys. Um, but yes. The Crossworld Link Shell is lar... Well, that doesn't matter. You can join the fellowship whenever you want, though. It's, um... I, I gave it a shitty name, so I'm sorry about that, but... Uh, Lars Potatars. I, uh... Is there a limit? Oh, 200. Blech. Okay. So, 200 people in that. How many people can be in the Link Shell? I don't think... Ah! Stop it! <laughs> uh, 64 people can be in the Crossworld Link Shell. Alright. <sighs> but, the thing... If, if you guys in chat feel like lending me your eyeballs... Um, yeah, WH Justice. Some people can be working on Twitch. It's the best. I, I basically had Twitch up all the time when I was when I worked at Rooster Teeth. And basically the same thing now when I'm working at home. Uh, just in a different way. Uh, but if you guys in Twitch, or if you guys in Twitch chat can spare your eyeballs. And if you're at work, obviously you can't, but just the thing I'm looking out for now is... Is the video feed smooth and buttery? And does it flicker? Like, I've had problems with like black flickering of just like weird little boxes. Just losing bits of frames. Um, so, if if the feed is smooth and buttery and you don't see any black boxes flickering and flashing around, then I think we've got a solution. The thing that I'm... I basically figured out... I messed around with some GPU scaling options and NVIDIA drivers, and it seems like I have it set. Is this from new hardware? No. This is from me trying to reconfigure hardware that I already have installed. Oh. Make some people admins on here. We can get people invites to Link Shell even when you're not online. Um, I'm gonna get to know people first. Um, actually, oh boy, damn it! I don't know any of the the Link Shell commands by heart yet. There. It's good so far. It's good to know. Um, uh, there we go. <laughs> I like how I have to stand on a hay bale to be almost eye level with this cat person. It's the best video game ever made. Ah! Oh, okay. <laughs> so tall! <laughs> I love how the characters uh, actually eye track to what you're what you're targeting. Oh, hey, Sir Dryleaf, welcome. We tried running Eden's verse. I can't. Uh, I'm not. My item level isn't high enough yet. Um, I am 4:49. I'm waiting for three more DPS, four more healers, and one more tank. God damn it. Uh, so I've done Eden one through four, but I can't. I can't do this yet. I really want to. Really excited to. What's up, Sue, uh, Solo Knight? How you doing? I'm just doing some, uh, some tech testing, hopefully. 
you have gill, you can buy crafted 380. Oh, uh, that's a good point. Probably not much. Um, I have 800k. Um, let me, I don't know, maybe? I'll, I'll blow gill going back to my, uh, my hometown. Just watching a cube for this game makes me miss it. Did you used to play Big Bucket Energy? I'm, uh... Now that I quit my job, I'm excited. Start with a weapon? Yeah, Dreyfus. Very good advice. Because, I know, like, I have... I think I have a 455 weapon right now, but yes. I feel like weapon is the hardest thing to get. Oh, 450, yeah. Let me, let me check and see what the, uh... How the markets are. Ring copied Factory yesterday for the first time. Shit was dope. Yeah, uh... Oh, frick. It's funny, because most people look at this game and they're like, I have no idea what I'm looking at. I've been able to, like, since I've played it for years, you know, I've been able to scale up. But, Copied Factory is a whole bunch of visual noise to the extent where even I'm like, oh my god, it's hard to hard to know what to look at. I know that a lot of people will turn their uh, display options down, or rather that was recommended to me. Dancer, Thaumaturge, Red Mage, Conjurer, thank you. Sort by... Fuck. Alright, fine. You can't sort by level? What? Quantity, demand, magic damage, intelligence. Oh. Wait. Four eighty? Okay, that's what I need, yeah. Oh, that's not bad. I can afford that. I don't know why I keep forgetting that this is in the damn game. That you can just buy gear. Ah. Oh. Holy crap, what's wrong with me? No! No! Oh! Oh! Okay, well, whatever. Already sorted by level? Okay, thank you, Reliable. I'm an idiot. It took me a second. How much are the subs for the game? I think it's like 13 to $14 a month, if you pay for it monthly. Um... <laughs> Time to Bitcoin leverage, yeah. Keep my action display on minimum for other players? Oh, you can do that? I didn't know it affected other players. Oh, $13 for one character? Okay. You only need one character, though. <sighs> Hello, kill, kill of the boss. I'm gonna try to kill the boss. Sell your, all your old CSGO skins. Uh, hey, 98T man. Hey, yeah, I remember you. Uh, been a, a first time I popped in since you went solo. Uh, it's going pretty well, 98T man. I am, I am, I think, at the tail end of a long tumble down, basically rebuilding my tech setup from the ground up, kind of. One thing led to another thing, led to another thing, and I kept identifying all these inconsistencies and inefficiencies in my, like, rendering and output process. The thing that seemed to help, or the thing that I was, the cardinal sin I was committing before, was that I was sending 144 hertz to a 60 hertz capture, which my capture was really stuttery, because the frames weren't evenly interpolated in time, so... Even if I drop frames now, it should still look smoother, because it's not like all the frames should be the same distance apart. Because um, I'm rendering at 120 and then capturing at 60. That set off all kinds of other problems with my dumb, dumbass capture hardware, but... Uh, so I'm B? Okay, so I should be in the middle. All the time. There's so many names. I should probably turn off name cards while I'm doing raids like this. I feel like that would help. Or, like, name cards that are not my party. That's probably an option, right? God, I don't know where, though. Yeah, this music is so, so good. Yeah, uh, Homie, Homie Dill, or Home Dillis, uh, if you've never played a Final Fantasy before, this dungeon in particular is the least, the least, uh, indicative thing, so. Apologies in advance. 
Uh, cause you're about to see some wild shit. Oh, okay, that's not hitting me. Don't they come from behind, though? Oh, fuck, it is hitting me! Ah! Oops. Oh, they got him already. All right. Shit. Uh, oh no, this is Kill of the Boss. This is a near raid. This is 100% uh, near. So if you're reminded of near, that is that is for a reason, and it is because this is a a, a near automata tie-in. The music and the the robots and everything, yeah. Yeah, I need to turn off those name cards. That would help a bit. And maybe maybe scoot this over here. I don't know why it's in the middle like that. Shit! What the fuck? Oh, I didn't see him up there. Damn it. Uh. That was dumb. I was like, why Why isn't there anything right here? What an easy place to stand. I got played. Uh. What? I thought he used... There. Okay. There we go. I did something. I did something useful. Fuck. Oh, oh, that's right, okay. It's one than the other. I wasn't paying attention to the... Come on, Sterk. I raise you, dude. Get off the ground. No time for a nap. Oh! Christ, man. Forgot how tough this is. Maybe you didn't see. Come on, bud. How many times do you want me to... Oh, I'm not going to do that now. Oh, Mikey Kona, thank you for the sub. No, it's okay. Oh, you haven't subbed yet. That's fine. How many times I got to raise you? Uh-oh, shit. Lost a tank. Fuck. Oh, I already got him. Ah, that dude's just not paying attention, I guess. Been any times with other Final Fantasy big bats showing up in this game? Absolutely. Um, uh, yeah, no, there, there's a whole a raid series going on right now for Final Fantasy VIII, um, and then they've done stuff. They've done tie-ins with Final Fantasy XII. They've done. Um, there are like, there are other little littler nods. They there's a pretty big time with Final Fantasy III. Ah! The, um, the NES game that actually never got localized until recently. Fuck. Damn it. Shit. So there's, there's been some cool stuff going on. Um, there are like, and there are also, there's just always like bosses and mounts and music. There are tons of, ah, oh shit. Ah, oh, oh, oh. What? God damn it. Why does that get me every time? Yeah, they did a 15 tie-in. You could get the uh, the regalia. So Clatteroth stuff allowed as a boss name. So fun. No, that's not a boss name. That's me. That's my trolley ass name. Oh fuck! I didn't see the order. Fuck. Ah! Damn. I'm doing terribly. What's up, Mythic Dragon? I think it might just be an AoE with the look of a bullet hell stuff. It might be. Yeah, because I, I I, tried to like visually dodge all the orbs and I was just getting walloped, so... I think you're right. 
Uh, again, uh, the point of this stream, aside from just hanging out and spreading spreading the good word of Final Fantasy XIV, I just want to make sure that like the stream looks smooth and is not flickering weirdly at all. Uh, because if it's if that's the case, then uh, I think I've I think I've found a solution to my uh, my tech woes that only took a million years to figure out. Okay. He already raised him, damn it. Where are you? There. Shit. Swinky pants already went down again. Neat. That's cool. Whew. Oh man. I gotta I gotta wake up a little bit here. Ooh, 460 poop 460 pants. Uh yeah, I unfortunately just bought new boots. Alright, well. I didn't know you got 460 from this dungeon, man. I gotta. 453, yes! Oh, well, okay, that was fast. Crap, that frustrates me. I could have done that the whole time. Oh well, this is the this is the benefit of streaming, I guess, is that people can tell you when you're being an idiot. Yeah, you're right on the you right on the little robots. It's cute. Hello, Eno. Welcome. Good morning. And then two P is down there. I don't know. I don't know if 2P is in Automata or if 2P is just another robot or another uh, whatever they're called, android replicant. Not able to run this before your subscription was up. Nice. Yeah, this is this is a cool, uh, cool piece of content. Well, yes, I am a magical tater boy. Yeah. Okay. That dude. That dude went AFK pretty quickly. I'm gonna farm the Rathalos mount now that it's able to be done unsynced. Oh, I actually haven't done Rathalos at all, so I still need to do it for the first time. It's still in my it's still in my finder here. Wait, where is it? Whatever, it's in there somewhere. Yeah, there it is. I haven't even done it, so <laughs> I'm very slowly um, catching up on all the content that I just never had time to do. Fuck, that was our off-tank one, boss. I, mean, I guess I'll just hit something. Do some damage. I guess this is 14, but when did it become near Automata? Final Fantasy 14 is every video game. It's all of them, all together. Everything you ever need in a video game. Even about three world transfers? <laughs> Haven't done the 24 man raids for Stormblood either. Dude, it's so hype. You mean uh, Eden? I've done Eden, the first part of Eden. Um, I'm not sure which other ones you're referring to. Oh yeah, the Monster Hunter movie by Tal Paul Anderson, starring Mila Jovovich. The the, the dynamic duo is back. Uh, oh, the twelve raids from Stormblood. Yeah, uh, yes, I did do those. I don't quite remember them. Um, not at the top of my not at the top of my head, but yeah. What's the GTA part of fourteen like? Uh, let me think. I guess I guess as long as you get the regalia mount, you can. Drive around with your homies. Alexa, play Superman, get my gold finger. <laughs> exactly. Tony Anime's Pro Skater. We just need a Final Fantasy and WoW crossover. Oh man, that would be that would be pretty next level. Can't remember this fight. Oh, I'm sure I'll get killed plenty, but uh, but yeah, if if it's not flickering. And all the uh, all the frames are buttery smooth. I think we're in a good spot. 
Now I just have to be careful, because if I ever set a game to full screen, then it will push my capture to the refresh rate of my desktop. Um, and then it would probably start flickering again. But luckily, most games now have like windowed or borderless window display options. So as long as it's like that, I'm set. Everybody's moving here, so I'll move there too. A lot of the times I'll just look at the other white mage and see what they're doing. Make sure that I'm doing the right thing at the right time. I'm spamming DPS. I don't like that big claw up there. I don't like that. Bro! How was I supposed to not get hit by that? Well, at least the other white mage got hit too. <laughs> Love this fucking raid. Can't wait to see the next installment a few months down the line. Yeah. It's, uh, it's... I don't know what those arrows mean. What the fuck? Oh, that means it, like, moves inward. Okay. That's interesting. Got it. Yeah, it feels good because I feel like I'm finally getting to the point where I can start getting into endgame content again. I have the time. And more importantly, I have chat here to, to tell me when I'm not... when I'm wasting time doing roulettes and could just spend money on a weapon. I did not think I would be able to, uh... Bought my item level up that quickly. Super, super useful. Ah, fuck. Oh. Man, good moves by that tank. Damn it. There. It's like a little bit off. Hey, Velvet Bite. Good to see you again. Is that from Summoner? What? Oh. Cute. I do. I do really like the like forced movement mechanics they've been sprinkling into more and more dungeons. They're finding they find clever ways to use it too. Like the one where you have to like put the seeds on the grid so that they move around to places where they won't grow. And then they like combine it with this shit. I'm like, ah, like people with AOEs. Uh, ow, that wasn't bad. Good job, everybody. Is it possible to get into this game noob or is it long time player only? No, Redden. So there's definitely um, a path for new players. The problem is that path involves going through older content, but they're currently they they're having discussions now about revamping that content. So. Um, you can get into it now. It's just the content will be a little bit older and more dated. A little bit harder to get through. Um, at least that's that's been... Ah, shit. That's been the uh, what a lot of people have reported, basically. So, if you, if you have a stomach for MMO grind, you can start at the beginning. Um... And the other healer goes down, it's time for me to go to work. It's the least I could do, really. To, uh, for all the healing that got done before. Fuck. Alright. 
this, and then the lasers come down. Okay. Oh, lost him. Lost him again. Uh, nine seconds? Alright, I'll wait, I'll wait. Shit! Two, one, shit. Oh! Already raised. Ah! Don't have an instant kill yet either. Um. Oh, all right. I got a. I got a hard cast. I'm out of it. Ah, I'm out of mana. I don't know how that. Who's who's doing the battle reses that isn't me? Um. Somebody else is bringing the white mage back sometimes, and I can't really track who that is. Ow. Fuck, man. Whew. Oh, Summoner? Okay. Super, super useful. Ring laser! Position myself. Bump. Ow! Holy shit, ow! I got very lucky not dying there. Um, other people, not so lucky. Oh, woo! Woo! Somehow did not die. Cool. <sighs> Healing is a masochist stream. I like it. I like the I like the pressure. I like the technique. I like the planning. Cause for me, if like I like healing in this game because you know when you've done a good job. Like, it's it's very apparent when you clutched it out. Like, and even if other people can't tell, you know, and that's kind of what matters the most to me. I feel like DPS is important. Like, you, there are a ton of, a ton of, uh, bosses that have DPS and, like, um, uh, what's the word? That have, like, a, a fucking god. I have like Berserk timers and stuff, so you, DPS needs to be good, but it's like all of DPS needs to be good. Whereas in certain fights, like one healer can definitely make the difference. Yeah, you're not a heal bot, and your DPS is important. Yeah, you can't just, you can't just flowchart healing. They make, uh, they make it pretty, pretty, uh, pretty clear that like you have to be aware of what you're doing and when. And then yeah, the DPS aspect is really interesting too, so I love the way it all ties together. If your party's good and they don't take a lot of damage, then you don't need to heal as much, which means you can DPS more. Um, but if your DPS keep dying and you have to keep rezzing them, then that's mana you're not spending on damage or keeping other people topped up. So it's a, it's a really fun game um, to try and uh, like play most efficiently. Fuck. Fuck! I did not know how to handle that. Both of our healers are down. Now you gotta go back to work? Okay. Like it kinda. Thank you for watching. What do you do to calm yourself when you've had a bad day? Are there any techniques you have? Uh, it depends. Um, I would say the, the least healthy one is to drink. Just have a few drinks and forget about it. I mean, one, one or two... One beer is not... Or one glass of wine is not gonna, like destroy your body and wreck your diet, but it's been hacked! That is a that is a coping mechanism. The far more healthy one is to um, is to uh, work out. Exercise uh, is a definite way to get your body to both relieve stress and produce endorphins. Um, and it can be hard, like sometimes when you're stressed and out of out of energy to ah! Uh, why did it track that way? Damn it! I was trying to run away from it. I ended up running right through it. Um, sometimes the last thing you want to do if you've had a bad day is, you know, go work out. But 
typically what I do is like one way to find motivation is to like focus on the things that stress you out and then use that like that spite. Uh, playing video games and jacking off. I mean, yeah. Rubbing one out uh, can can be a little burst of a uh, of motivation. Um, food, like there there are a ton of unhealthy coping mechanisms. The good the good news is that food can be a positive thing. So instead of going and eating pizza, like if you just have if you can find like a restaurant or something that does like really nice chicken or something like that, just like a really nice uh, meal that's healthy can also just make you feel really good because often like I find that like bad food is good when you're eating it but you just feel like shit after and especially like even um even chemically if you eat like a lot of carbs then your body has that fallout of uh of blood sugar and it just makes you feel like shit but if you have a nice well prepared well cooked delicious meal um that can uh that can go a long way Taking a shower, yeah. Have a bath. There are a lot of kind of, I would guess, more stereotypical like stress cures, but I would I would say like the important thing is to uh, figure out coping mechanisms that are sustainable and, and constructive, which is not something that I was necessarily that good at, if I'm being honest. Um, I put on a lot of weight in 2019 just from work stress at Rooster Teeth, which is is great now that I'm away from that. I'm, I'm taking a little better uh, care of myself, and I'm, I'm finding the weight starting to come off, but I, you know, I'm saying all this stuff after just going, going through a phase where I did not practice any of it, you know? So, it's tough. It's tough. It can be hard. Play Raid Shadow Legends, TM. Um, yes, you could do that. Give money to your favorite streamer. That's always therapeutic, right? Oh, this, this fucking guy, man. I have nightmares from this. I'm trying to play Nier Automata on hard. Yeah, a walk. Going for a walk. It sounds so stupid, but a lot of times in life, a lot of times when I've been super, uh, super stressed out, really, um, going for a good 40 minute walk. Because, like, the exercise is nice. There's something meditative about just putting one foot in front of the other. I would say going for a walk and then, like, listening to some really calming music. I have, like, a. Um, I've been gravitating towards, what is it called, um, I don't know what it's called, but like there's there's some groups like Poolside, Air, there's some groups that do just like really chill, electronic, like almost bossa nova type music, and it is super, super relaxing. I don't know what that means. Should I get away from you? Oh, okay. So going for a walk, putting on some chill music, and just sort of like being outside, and uh, depending on where you are too, sometimes it, it like helps give you a little bit of perspective of like you can be trapped in your own. What's happening? Why is there an arrow on me? What does this mean? Um, you can kind of be trapped in your own problems and consumed with, which is fine. Everyone gets this way. Ah, uh, what the fuck? Oh, it ah! I didn't know it hit multiple times. Um, oops. Chasing AoE. Okay, <laughs> oops. I know now. Uh, that's good to know, though. Thank you. <laughs> that's a whoopsie. That's a whoops. We're gonna call whoopsie on that one. Ah! Shit. God, these raids are always so hard. It's like, once you start making a mistake, and then you are consumed with the mistake you just made, instead of keep paying attention and making sure that you're prepared for the next thing... I fall behind very easily. Max smash. Everyone seems to be scattering, so I should scatter. <sighs> oh! Put cards and sleeving cards helps me relax? Yeah! Uh, jigsaw puzzles? Um, for me, uh, playing rhythm games? Or just, just difficult video games in general? Was always meditative. Rhythm especially though, because you, you know, you're listening to music, you're hitting buttons. There's something calming about that. Uh. What's up, Solo Samurai? What is... Is it one person in every... Okay. Is 
Yes, stay away. Stay away from the, uh, the, the leper, the unclean. Oh, is this DPS? DPS check. Oh, that's the one my team is on. Should, should help my team out first, huh? Be running back here. Sure thing. Smashing those rock band drums. Yeah, rock band. Um, for me, Beat Mania 2DX was always kind of my meditative center, which I'm really excited. I uh, I ordered a Beat Mania controller. It should be coming in a week or two. And then I uh, there's. Some kind folks from Bomani Style shared with, uh, put together a guide about how to get Infinitas working at home. So, believe me, there's going to be some DJ streams coming up. Whoa! All right, forgot about that part. Ugh. I want to heal, but I want to use my angry flower first. There we go. Rolling dice? Well, I can see that being meditative, yeah. I think the key is, like, find something physical to do. It doesn't have to be exercise, but, like, something physical with your hands. Knitting. Putting together a puzzle. Um, playing a video game, you know? Um, I think I think it's been fairly, fairly well studied and documented that that helps induce a, a, a kind of a recovery mental state, a meditative state. It's called flow, if you want to look it up. Um... Really, I think I think in terms like that, it's okay to like m let your thinking mind uh, intentionally do things that you emotionally may not want to do because your thinking mind knows it'll help. So that's part of it too. I think is is getting in the place where you can get out of just being controlled by your your stress and your emotions, and thinking about it more in terms of like this is a uh, a state that needs to be managed, and part of that management is um, doing the thing that I intellectually know will be better for me, not the thing that I emotionally think will be better for me. I've, I've found a lot of success uh, employing that more in my life, which is, you know, not easy to do. That makes it sound trivial. Like, just do the just do the perfect thing all the time. It's not, obviously not that easy, but uh, where's everybody going? Freaking me out here. Fuck. Was the one you raised, okay. Ah, uh, shit. Fuck, that's dumb. Well, whatever. Ten seconds till swift cast, so who cares? Almost there. race that I was not paying attention to. Master of Shans. Hey, thank you for gifting us up. Hey, Eve. I uh, had a mental breakdown today, so I took time off the rest of the week to do something nice for myself. That's fine, too. Um, there, No one in your life 
uh, especially in work circumstances, unless you're extremely lucky, no one's gonna tell you to take a break. That's not in anyone's interest. So you gotta look out for yourself there. If, if you find that work is stressing you out, um, to some degree it is kind of on you to be like, this is shitty, I'm not being productive, I need to take a break. And if your boss is push it back on you for that, first of all, it's a shit boss, but second of all, you still gotta stick up for yourself, I think. It's a, it's a shame. I, I feel like the goal, the goal of a, a good manager should be to to ensure the mental and physical well-being of everyone that's working with them. And uh, I think part of that is is tracking when people are overworking or maybe not in the best mental state and push them out of it. Be like, hey, go home. Shut up. Stop it. No. No. Stop working. Yeah. Save this for the podcast. Uh, I mean, it's, uh... I'm talking about it now. It's not like we're gonna be starved for things to talk about, I'm sure. Um, tell that to the managers of EPS. I mean, tell that to everyone in America, it seems like. American work culture is kind of fucked. Um, and it's, it's frustrating because, like, the American GDP is pretty great, but it's all only... It's all going to the fucking ultra-rich! We work our asses off so that we can have more billionaires in America than everyone else? I don't know. Sorry. I saw the Marx crush and I'm like, ugh, it's in my mind now. Uh, I don't know. When I think about it, I'm like, what's the point, man? Europeans take like months off at a time and they may not have as many billionaires, but at least they don't kill themselves and they get time off and they get to live their lives. They get to like explore, they get to go on vacations and explore and not have to pay hundreds of thousands of dollars for healthcare and oh boohoo no there's no billionaires because Rupert Murdoch isn't there telling everyone to vote against their own interests sorry this shouldn't become a political rant it just frustrates me man how like how there are different systems and different forms of government in the world and you can see straight away the impact it has on people and their lives and none of that matters none of that matters when, uh, when Fox News can scream at people. Anyway. That's Brits know how to screw over our poor as well. Yeah. Rip, uh, rip the NHS, I guess. God damn it, another pair of boots, huh? Shit. Oh well, that's fine. I don't need a... I don't need item level anymore. The American way of work is all product related, rather than what it takes to get there. Yeah. Basically just the, uh, the ends justify the means in all circumstances. It's, uh, it's all, and it's also short-sighted too, at least, at least in the, in the, to the extent that, like, people are trying to become the next billionaire, so. You f form a startup, you make, make an entire business plan around just selling the thing. And that involves, like, grinding people down, because you're telling them you have equity. So you, you work your ass off for a year, we're gonna sell, we're gonna make a shitload of money, and we'll be done. It has nothing to do with the product or the service or, like, taking pride in your work, it's just grind it out, get the numbers up. Then we can sell and get the fuck out of here. Uh, Bernie Sanders talked about needing to change that paradigm of how we view the top 1% as a marker for the state of our country. We should instead be looking at the poorest communities as to how well our country is doing. I mean, yeah. Yes, but... Nobody's gonna saturate Fox News with ads about caring for the poor. Because nobody thinks they're poor. Or if they do, it's because there's somebody else to blame. And it's never, like... It's always the Browns, or something like that, I don't know. It's always the fact that you have to pay for other people's health care. Something. It's, it's always scapegoat shit. Anyway, I'll, I'll back off of that for now. That wasn't supposed to be... We were talking about stress. Yes, so to roll it back, I guess just realize also that the... If you're, especially if you're stressed in North America, work culture is not there to make you a happy, healthy person. And to some degree, you kind of have to take your own... You have to take uh, your own fate into your own hands there and decide what you can and can't tolerate. Why is everybody moving? I don't like this. Oh, there's a big grindy wheel right there. Okay. Holy shit, this music though. I'm feeling fucking inspired right now. They even mixed it. They, 
They mixed the Final Fantasy prelude into it? That's fucking awesome! Ah! I know I've heard this before, but still. Oh, fuck you. Alright. You gotta remember. Oh, man. I don't... There's not an extreme version of this raid yet, but I can see that getting very, very bad. Wait. Oh, Embolden. I thought it said Embiggen. I was like, are you serious? We're dropping Simpsons memes now? They're, uh... That's one of the other things I really like about Final Fantasy XIV is the localization team. It gets a little cheeky with their translations sometimes. I, re I actually really appreciate it. Potato legs. Okay. I. Oh fuck! Now that one's gonna blow up. Are you serious? I didn't know that. I didn't know that. Eh! Okay. I think I'm safe. Okay. Fuck. fuck. One of the raids from last year had Ty's pod as an attack? Yeah. It's, uh, it's, it's fantastic. There's, like, um, one of my favorites, the one that I always remember is, uh, there was a, um, there's a quest to fight Ifrit, and, uh, the quest name was Ifrit Bleeds, We Can Kill It. <laughs> you can't, you can't be throwing Predator references in fucking Final Fantasy XIV. But you did. And I love you. So there's there's just a, a lot of it's weird because you'd never you'd never know it just by looking at the game. But there's just so much humanity in this game, uh, humor. It's just kind of tucked away, little references and things. Yeah, The Witcher also has a bunch of cheeky quest line or quest names. That kind of combined with uh, oh, there's a David Bowie reference in one of the DLCs. Nice. Final Fantasy XIV is a sparkling mess with 10 out of 10 anime music. Very well said. 100% agree. Swinky pants. Oh, 
Oh, my sweet swinky pants. Wait, I want to get here first. Okay, so I gotta go back and forth. Alright. Mmm. Fuck, I wish I hadn't used my swift cast on the DPS. Now I gotta wait. Shit! Ah! Oh, somebody brought him up. Good. Okay. See, this is the this is like the ricochet effect of, or the the um. Only one. Oh, ah, ooh, ah, ooh, ooh, ooh. Fuck. Shit. Mmm. 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 Mm. Crap. Oh boy, they go wild with those DPS, uh, DPS hits. What the fuck? What the fuck? This is how much coffee's left. And I like, I put it down and it sloshed out of the fucking spout onto my face and shirt. What the absolute fuck? How does that happen? God. I swear to God, I'm in some kind of like physics vortex. That shit happens to me all the time. And I don't know why. Like things just fucking, oh, stop it. Sorry, I shouldn't yell like that. I know that overloads the mic. I'm just, uh... Ah! God! I don't want to stain my shirt. I like this shirt. Ah! Rip it off. Everyone keeps saying that. Absolutely not allowed. On Twitch. Fuck. God damn it. Where are you? Where's your damn where's your damn body? Just raise you! Click the button! Click it! Why aren't you... Could I... Okay, thank you. Ugh. How are you... Red box is bad. Yeah, I got it. Um, I just don't know those, those instant DPS hits are fucking wiping me. Uh, Taylor Jess, thanks for the Prime sub. I, I don't know, I guess I have to watch where it's pointing? And then it, it'll turn to me and... Uh oh. Or is this like... Is this the, uh... Fuck. No, not Asuna. Fuck, man, I don't have anything! I have no tools. Ooh, okay. Oh dear, there's dual flak uh, front and behind? Okay. Oh! Gonna need all those, gonna need those triple triad cards though. Um, does it tell you if you already have one? Oh wait, I didn't... Type 2 attire? Oh actually wait, I already have that, I shouldn't need on that. Always the other healer. Oh Taylor, you can't stay? Alright, well thank you for dropping off your uh... Your Amazon money. Dual flak is a side attack? Jeez. One is called front hind laser, the other one is called flank lasers. You gotta watch his cast bar. Okay. I was definitely not doing that. Oh, there's more loot. 
that I cannot wear. All right. Don't forget to open your treasure coffer. I don't know when I got that. Um, what do you mean? I don't think I got one. Am I wrong? Uh, also, I want to turn off... Where would that be? Uh, I'm gonna go spot scrub my shirt. Alright, well. What are those raid frames called? Raid frames. You mean like these? The ones that showed the other parties? Um, I need to figure out um, character config, battle display. Alright, thank you. Aha. I wish you could resize these windows. They're a little small. Um, hot bar. Oh, wait. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Alliance. Okay. Name settings when targeted. Title display settings. HP bar. Settings. Eh. I... If I've got this thing, I don't need to see people's bars running around. Pet display. I don't need to see people's pets. What is title display? Oh, that's like, yeah. People's titles. Eh. Okay. That seems good. <sighs> right click top of window to resize. Oh! Alright. Oh, that's scaling. Yeah, sorry, I, I meant like, I want to be able to like, make it longer vertically. I don't need it just to flat be bigger. Uh, hey, Dr. DJ Ice. I'm doing pretty good. Um, it seems like the stream is pretty solid. I'm getting my frames. There hasn't been any flickering, I assume, so I think I've found a good solution here. Um, Alright, I gotta use the restroom. I'll be right back. And then I get to do new, some new content, I guess. Game business is GLA okay, John I'm gonna test something here. Got my other... Got my stream up over here. So I'm actually gonna see if my, uh, my frames are as buttery smooth as I hope they are. That's pretty buttery, baby. Okay, good. Yes, it does. Okay. Do I dare? Do I dare believe the impossible? Have I finally achieved uh, Twitch Nirvana? Hey, Una. Cool. Watching VODs, catching up about them when I can, but down for some live. Yeah, I kind of went quickly live. I've only got about another... Oh, I've only got about 30 minutes left before I got ahead to Bruce's for the podcast. Is that... Is 30 minutes enough time to do Ruby? Um, ruby weapon? What? Oh, wait, what happened? I thought it was like over 450. Never mind. I guess I'm not, never mind. Well, I guess I'll, uh, I guess I'll do a roulette then. Oh wait, how much, how much? No, I don't have enough to buy something, I don't think. It's fairly short, okay. Unfortunately, I thought, I thought I had done it. But, uh, I need, I need new pants! I need to pants badly. That's the only thing holding me back right now. Um, let's see. Expert or 80 lights for tombstones? Yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah. I mean, um... F so, 50, 60, 70 actually gives the most... Um, so... There. Um, see, like, this gives 120 Phantasmagoria, but... This is so little! You get so little allegory. Um, and like that's the fastest way to... I know that that shit's higher level, but... I need 825 for the pants! Why are they so expensive? Christ! Wait a minute, I can buy pants. What's wrong with me? I keep forgetting. And now I gotta teleport back. Uh, there's no trading board here, is there? No. 
Might as well repair, I guess. S still got some from the bosses in the dungeon? Oh, that's true. Yeah, I haven't really added it all up. What is this for? There's some junk in my inventory that I've got to, like... I need to, like, just look it up on a Final Fantasy wiki and see why I have it. Um, roulette is best for allegory? Yeah. Expert roulette? You get so little, though. Holy crap. Ugh. Hold on. Daily bonus is 40, you still get the 50 for the dungeon itself. You get 90 allegory for the first expert roulette a day. One expert roulette, five different days, equals 450, the weekly cap. Uh -huh. Yeah, I, I hear ya. Frozen Ocelot, that makes sense. It's mostly, well, the thing that I never got into is, is just doing one roulette a day, because I never really had the free time. Um, but maybe I will now. Got to thank for some strats in 99. Still got to get better, but getting closer. Oh, well, man, I'm I'm figuring them out myself, so I'm, I'm far from the master. So let me see here. Uh, I don't think I'll have... Well, maybe I'll have time. If I can buy some new pants. Um, Dungeons give allegory as well. Yeah, just not as much. Alright. Pants. 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 480. Wait. How is it less? That's weird. I mean, it's really high, though. Oh, those are expensive as shit! Uh, 450? How about you? Ah, oh, that's, that's a lot better. And that should at least put me up to 455, I would think. 100k? Sure. Alright. Yeah! Yes! Yes, let's go! Alright. Ruby weapon. Uh, is there anything I need to know for, uh... Is there anything I need to know for Ruby, or am I just going to get bopped? Make sure you get high quality. Oh, well, too late, I guess. All I wanted was the fucking level, like... Oh yeah, Master, if, um... Ruby is easy as hell? Okay. It's going blind. Sick. I'm ho kind of hoping it'll have, uh... Final Fantasy VII music. Don't spoil it! Don't stand in the quicksand. Okay. I can handle that. Oh, you fight it in a desert? Just like Seven? <laughs> oh wait, was Ruby the one that was underwater? Going in blind is how you should do things? I agree, but whenever you do, um... That's, that's pretty inconsiderate sometimes. Uh, Emerald was the underwater one, gotcha. Mm. If you're doing, like, experts or something like that, I feel like you should look up the, um, the attack strategies and the phases and stuff first. Hey, Dapper Cactar. Good to see you. Okay. I'm trying to keep an eye on the time here. Less than five minutes. Just need one more healer! Um, I should get some shit for clearing this, too. Oh, not much, though. So, and cool, I can do, uh, I can do Eden's Verse now, too. Uh, J. Rad McCarthy, thanks for the sub. Very much appreciate it. Yeah, it's still not much Final Fantasy IX stuff. Not yet! It does seem like they're kind of iterating through all the Final Fantasies and giving each game their, its own little moment to shine. Yeah, first time bonus. Yeah, that's exciting. Still not doing super hot on currencies in general. Discontinued. I don't know why they keep giving me poetics. I can't do anything with poetics. I... man. Did the EX blind and only died to one mechanic because I wasn't looking for where the tell was coming from? Oh, wow. Okay. Forgot how rough Golden Saucer MGP grinding is for the good rewards. Yeah, I mean, there's the, um... I haven't gotten into Chocobo Racing. Maybe I'll pick that up. But yeah, I have... I have debated just tripping full on... Can you trade up... Can't you trade up the poetics? Can you? Gear for all classes, you can mix some gill with it. Oh. Okay. Yeah, I don't really... Can you use poetics for uh, Disciples of the Hand or the Land? Because I've done some weaving and some fishing. So maybe I could get gear with that.
fuck is going on with this music? Yep, that's just Ultima but red. Okay. <laughs> Taco Supreme? Is that the person who was just asking about tacos? Dreyfus? You like beef soft tacos? Sure, yes, I do. Why is everybody talking about tacos all of a sudden? I don't understand. Oh, it's... <laughs> it's like Final Fantasy VII style notification window? That's what it looked like. It's like teddy bear is fighting. What the fuck? Oh, that's what you mean by stay out of the... Alright. I thought I wasn't supposed to stand on that. Got it. I didn't see the other one! Rah! Listen when the chorus plays again? I will try. Shit, shit. I don't think I can... I can't survive this. I can't cast in time. <sighs> Fuck. All my... All my instants were up. Just die, dude. Why are you using, like, abilities and stuff? What's up, NA fam? Why does everybody keep talking about tacos? I genuinely don't understand. The lyrics? Oh, sorry. keep singing about them i've i don't hear it yet but i'll keep an ear out twisted irish thanks for the prime sub oh aren't you talking about tacos fair fair question
Okay, I get I hear it now. Okay, I okay. I hear it. I gotta admit that <laughs> takes some of the vibe away from the song, <laughs> or does it only add to it? I don't know. I don't know anymore. I don't know anything. Got it. I hear it now. Okay. God damn it, now I'll never unhear it. Yeah, Teddy Man is pretty great. I guess Teddy Man is the new Frogman. <laughs> I never really got into Glamours, but I feel like I'm just on the precipice of, of being that guy. Imagine a little Potato Man wearing a 2B outfit. It's fantastic. So wait, should I not stand on it when it's lit up like that? And, oh. That's a pretty interesting AoE pattern to try and try and dodge. I like that. Why is it? Ah! Is that just fucking intentionally target healers? I bit that one pretty bad. Yeah. That's an F. Big F's on that one. Alright. Luckily, I can help Rez. everybody. We're really doing it. Ugh. Let's see if they'll let 
me get this cast off. Nope. What? Hey, man! Oh, okay. Never mind. Other one got him up. He's already dead again. Alright. Don't worry, bud. You die as many times as you need. That's what healers are for. Am I right? Am I right? We love it when people go down. It makes us feel important. Yes! Okay, that was a cool fight. Hmm. Yeah, robot, ro roboto fellas. So I think it's okay to not know what's going on. Uh, maybe, maybe that would be a fun way to play this game is to kind of explain to people what I'm thinking and how I'm playing as I'm doing it. It, requ it would require sort of breaking down all of, all of the healing tools I have. Oh wait, damn it, damn it! It's got a phase two, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Oh, 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 oh! Oh god, damn it! Another, another thing's gonna pop out of its back. Why wouldn't it be Final Fantasy? Oh! Ruby Weapon got boobs. Alright. It's gotta be three screens tall. Who the fuck is that? Mail Van Darnus? I don't even... Can anybody... Huh. Oh no, it's hot! This... Oh man, this music shift is something else. Remember Binding Coil? No! I didn't finish Coil! I didn't- I didn't do a lot of in-game stuff during Heaven's Word. I had a job. Then. Is this just fucking straight up opera? Nail was the head of the Meteor Project. Oh, okay. So there's some there's some hot lore happening right now that I just kind of going over my head. Music is, is hot as shit, though. Head behind this rock. Oh. What? What is this? What is this? What are we doing here? Huh? Why are we... What? Oh, this, this shows you where to stand to block the comets? Oh! Okay, I think I get it. Nope, 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 nope. Shit, shit! Fuck. Damn it! Awesome. Uh, shit, I'm pretty far away on my swift cast. God! Holy crap! Look at the sky. Anime blocks. Do we have to start the whole fight over? Oh yeah, I hope not. Oh, didn't get all the comets? Okay. She summons Dalamund? I don't know who that is. I don't remember. Uh, really, like the stream takes me back to some of my earliest gaming memories, watching my cousin play WoW and not knowing what the fuck was going on. I'm glad to hear that. Hopefully it's... 
it's it's somewhat appreciable by people who have no idea what the hell's going on. Who's who's Dalamund? I don't remember. Okay. All right. Oh, the other died. Gotcha. The exploding moon from the game intro. Dalamund was the moon that held Bahamut. Ah. Yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember a whole lot of Realm Reborn, Heavensward stuff. Just here, to, here to hear you rant about billionaires. Now, if you wait long enough, I'm sure I'll get back to that eventually. Fuck. You guys need to stop getting hurt. Stop it. like split up. It's difficult. I've only got so many AoEs. But that's what makes it that's what makes it interesting. Having to split the party in half and then do AoEs on each of them separately. Bullshit. Fuck. you emotionally, but I have no idea what's going on. That's fine. I appreciate that. I appreciate the support regardless. I don't really get the mechanic here. God, they all take so much damage. DPS! Do your- Damn it! You have to- Do something! Tanks have to block the comets while everyone destroys them, yeah. Uh, we only have two tanks though, and there's like four comets? I feel like DPS isn't breaking the comets? I don't know though. The party wipe moves are creating the cataclysm that ended 1.0. That's what I thought. Because that is. Meteor is what caused the, uh. The first, um. The first, like, cataclysm or whatever it's called. What do they call it? When one of the shards like over overloads, the DPS and tanks split between comets and the remaining kill comets, and healers keep healing. Yeah. Um, the comets didn't break. The rejoining, a uh, calamity. That's it, Una. Thank you. The rejoining is the thing that the Astians are trying to invoke, which happens because of calamities. Theoretically, there are four meteors. You could stand in the middle and heal everyone with AOE. Or take a comet yourself so DPS aren't stunned under them. Okay, I feel like I need to heal though. Because the deep the tanks are going down quickly. I guess it's a uh okay, yeah, now we're getting It's a whole thing. Yeah. This game's hard to watch on mobile. Yeah, there's a lot going on, and then on a tiny screen. I could see that being a problem. You get marked with a laser when the comets are being held, don't aim it at a tank. Oh, I didn't know that could happen. But I gotta... I gotta leave quickly. I gotta leave soon. Yeah, mom's calling me for dinner. 
Guys, I have to go to school. Take it on me, man! Oh, he didn't, okay. I was like, ugh. I thought this gentleman was not he helping. I think what'll also help is to not use my my little Healy Flower as soon as I get it, and wait for moments like these when I need instant AoE. AoE heals that seems to be a little more effective of a, yeah, I'll, I'll bank those up if I can. Use my other heals when I don't need instants. Instead of just getting them so I have the flower, I don't need to focus so much on DPS. Keep people alive. Fuck, oh, where's my cursor? Huh. Lost it for a second. Fuck. Nope. I just there I go, like disobeying my own my own idea. Yeah, we heals will hit everybody here. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. yeah. Good job. Good job. Oh, I lost a tank. Or not. Maybe it wasn't a good job after all. Why? What happened? Did we miss another meteor? is a spicy meatball. What are the ABC things? Those are markers that people put down to tell people where to stand during a particular phase. Not enough DPS. God damn it. I wondered if that was the problem. I mean, we have DPS that keeps keeps going down, so they're losing... Not enough DPS to beat the Enrage Timer. Mm -hmm. 
and this is when it's like DPS is kind of all lumped together, so I guess I can DPS more. I'll try to DPS more. Maybe I'll rely more on uh, heal over time. Don't. Don't! You have space where you are. Don't run at me. <laughs> yeah, use the hots instead of more spammy healing. Fucking guy. You have to stay on your feet and keep hitting the boss. That is your job. Oh, oops. Ah. Okay, that one that one's on me. This is going very well. Uh, crap, we're not gonna <sighs> giggle frith, giggle fits. I don't have, I don't have all day. It's your first time, or did you get a bad pug? Um, it's my first time playing, so I'm still trying to. I, I think I have a handle on the mechanics, but. We've gotten we've we've gotten through the phases. It's just the enrage timer hit because I guess DPS couldn't hit it fast enough. So so that's cool. So now I think like I'm trying to do more DPS. Shit! Fuck. Stop it! God. Hits are so heavy. How are you dead, dude? Did I just miss it? I don't understand. I keep losing people. There we go. 
Congratulations. You won. Okay. We can do it. I believe in us. Are you fucking kidding? Okay. Yep. Yeah, it's pot time anyway, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna be a little bit late. Come on! I'm gonna start putting on my shoes. <laughs> Ah, oh, that was civilized. Okay. Yeah, it happens. That's fine. Uh, it was a good learning experience. Okay, guys. Eh. It's pod time. Time to go to Bruce's and hang out. Podcast. And announce a new energy drink sponsor. Uh, making a lot of money this week. Got that Raid Shadow Legends cash. And my soon-to-be new energy drink sponsor. And some hot scoops on Cyberpunk. So, a lot coming up. Um, thank you guys. I didn't expect... I was just try gonna test out my capture setup, but... Luckily, it didn't seem like there were- uh, you guys didn't see any flickers. Granted, I've streamed for, uh, I've streamed for hours before without that happening, and it's just- it'll just pop up sometimes, but I think I'm in a pretty good spot here. Ugh. All right. Yeah. But I'll be back live on this channel in about 40 minutes or so, so I'll see you guys then. Yeah, stream seemed fine. Buttery smooth, no flickers. Hopefully we can keep it this way. We'll see. Alright. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you later.